Placing a bird bath in your garden is the perfect way to provide birds with a much needed clean water resource to both drink and bathe. Providing birds with a water source is important all year round. In the summer, it's vital as water can be scarce and during the winter, most natural water supplies may be frozen. So fresh water is essential for birds at this time of year too. Bird baths are not just for birds, they're also beneficial for mammals and insects looking for a source of water and can make a really attractive addition to your garden. They're available in a huge range of different styles and designs, but it can be hard to know which one is right for you and your garden. In this video, we will be going over the ideal bird bath the different types of bird baths available and where to place them, along with tips on accessibility, bird bath maintenance and cleaning. Dimensions and accessibility are two important things to consider when choosing a bird bath. The ideal bird bath will have very shallow sloping sides and a depth of 2.5 to 10 centimeters while being as wide as possible, ideally over 30 centimeters across. In terms of accessibility, it's a good idea to add stones to birth baths as they can create small islands for birds to stand on when drinking. You could also add ramps to allow insects and other mammals in and out of birth baths. There are three types of bird baths available, freestanding bird baths, ground baths and hanging baths. Freestanding bird baths are generally the most popular option available in a wide range of sizes, materials and designs. As the name suggests, they stand freely on a solid base with the bath positioned at the top. Here we have the RSBB birth bath, which comes in greens or bronze. Its simple yet attractive design means it will blend well into a variety of gardens no matter your decor style. It's made from lightweight weatherproof resin with a classic verdigris finish and has a shallow dish. It's easy to put together and comes with ground pegs included. This is the cast stone owl birth bath, which features a lovely little family of owls at the focal point. It's a really attractive design that works as both a beautiful ornament as well as a bird bath. Designed to look just like a real tree, the stem of the birth bath provides a strong and stable base for the large drinking bowl on top. It's finished in a frost-proof material, so should last through many chilly winters. The stem and the bowl are supplied separately, so we recommend using silicone adhesive or sealant to securely fix the stem to the bowl to ensure it is safe for use in gardens with children or pets. Ground bird baths are positioned on the ground and come in a range of styles and sizes. Some sit directly on the ground, while others may be raised slightly with the addition of feet. Some ground bird baths have the traditional sloping design, while others feature theatre steps or ripples to accommodate birds that like to step from the shallow edge of the bath. Here we have the Shenstone bird bath, which features the theatre step design. Beautifully decorated with the lines from W.H. Davies' poem, Leisure, this bird bath is made from polyboo, a mix of recycled plastic and bamboo. It's resistant to warping and cracking in heavy frost and ice, and it comes with a low stand to sit near the ground. This is the Echo Ceramic Bird Bath. As you can see, it features the first stanza from William Blake's poem, Auguries of Innocence, inscribed around the edge. To see a world in a grain of sand and heaven in a wildflower, Hold infinity in the palm of your hand and eternity in an hour. In a lovely glaze ceramic, it is high-fired, frost-resistant and sturdy. So it is totally functional as well as beautiful to look at. The rippled graduated depth adds interest to the bath and also it means it is safe for birds. As you can see, it comes with matching ceramic feet. It is 34 centimeters in diameter. Here we have the Wild Island Bird Bath. Handmade using clay and traditional pottery methods, it's a lovely piece and a great place for birds to drink. It features a wide rim and an island in the middle, giving birds lots of places for perching. The central island also features hand-stamped detailing of the ancient symbol for water, which holds a shallow level of water for bees and other insects to drink from. It has a diameter of 40 centimeters. Ideal for smaller gardens where floor space is minimal, hanging bird baths can be hung up easily using the chains provided so they can be placed almost anywhere you like. The RSPB Anywhere Bird Bath is a versatile and durable bird bath that, as the name suggests, can be used anywhere. You can hang it with the chains provided or remove them and place it on the ground or mounted on a ground bike. It has a diameter of 35 centimeters, making it perfect for smaller spaces. Where you decide to place your bird bath will ultimately impact which birds and how many come to visit. It's important you choose a spot where birds will feel safe. They tend to get excited and preoccupied when bathing, so can be at their most vulnerable. Therefore, make sure you place your bird bath somewhere where they will have clear visibility, 
with bushes and trees nearby so they can have color if alarmed and purchase to use when preening. This is an example of a great spot, as you can see, they have clear visibility, there is a tree nearby. Once you have chosen and installed your birth bat, it's crucial you keep on top of cleaning to ensure the bat stays safe for birds. You should replace the water daily and clean your birth bat at least once a week, emptying out any old water, scrubbing away any dirt or debris and refilling with fresh water. We have a whole video on how to clean feeders, tables and birth bats. Make sure to check it out here. When the temperature drops, natural water resources inevitably freeze over and so birds will need your birth bath more than ever. While it can be difficult to stop the water in your birth bath from freezing, there are a few things you can do to help. You could line the birth bath with polyethene sheet so that when it ices over, it can be easy to lift out. Another little trick is to place a light bowl in the water so that it'll be moved by the breeze and therefore a small amount of water will be ice free. Never add any additives to your birth bath, such as antifreeze solutions, as these are unsafe for birds. We hope this video has helped you when deciding which bird bath to buy. Make sure you check out our other videos. We cover everything from bird food to bird feeders, tables, creating a wildlife-friendly garden and more. <laughs>